Hey guys, this is Krishna Anwar. I am the founder of Rank Atom. This video is going to be a quick demo of what we have built till now at Rank Atom, so that you can start uh, taking this as a reference and start using it for your own purpose. So let's start with keyword research first. Okay, before we go into the keyword research, let's go to the settings. Uh, over here, you can add your own domain over here and your custom weak spots. Let's say you are thinking YouTube as your weak spot, you can add it over here. And if you switch on keyword golden ratio, it is going to consume two credits, two extra credits, one extra credit. So per keyword, it will be showing you one extra credit. And let's say at the keyword research, let's say we go with something really broad. Let's say SaaS growth is my seed keyword that I is going to go, that I'm going to go with. The reason behind going with a broader keyword is so that you get more keyword ideas to play with. You can select whatever country that you're targeting and whatever language that you that you want to go with for the targeting. Once you're done with that, click on find keywords. Now what this will do is it is going to start generating keyword ideas from the search. Now, once that is done, it will show you a tick mark and click on this. And it will show you what all keyword ideas it has generated. You can select what all keywords that you want to analyze one by one. Or else what I go with is select all and click on analyze. And it is going to show you how much credit it is going to consume. Now click on analyze now. You can play around with the filters depending on your strategy that you are going with. Depending on intent words, how many words. Um, if you want to go with long tail keywords, you can go with five to six words minimum, something like that. You can play around with this. This is really easy. Now, if you see the number of keywords is increasing, the reason behind that is it is our adding uh, PAA keywords that it is fetching from the analyze uh, to the main cluster to the entire corpus so that your keyword ideas keep on expand as you click on analyze. Okay. Once you have analyzed all the keywords, click on SERP analysis at the top so that we get to sort this entire list according to the in a descending order of uh, the number of weak spots. To check out what all weak spots it has found, click on this breadcrumb and it is going to show what all weak spots are coming in. For example, this is a load EA. This is a custom domain that we choose. Right? This is YouTube. We added YouTube in the beginning. right? And over here, you can check, uh, use this uh, parameter for your Google ad purposes. And if you click on people also ask, it is going to give you what all results it is giving. And it is adding these results to the entire corpus. And you can see if any ads are running. Oh, yeah. And once this is done, go to clusters, click on generate clusters. So what clustering does is, uh, we group keywords based on SERP results. So right now it has found you clusters over here. So the reason behind clustering is if you're going to target one keyword, you're going to target only, you're going to uh, fetch only 520 volume. Like the traffic would be 520. Combining these keywords and mixing it in the content like secondary keywords is going to increase the amount of them that you're going to target. And yeah, that's the entire thing about keyword research. What is with the software that you know how it goes. And let's jump into the rank tracking. It is very simple. It is used for uh, tracking how you are doing against the keyword that you have researched. Let's say we go with uh, rank item for rank item.
this I'll go with daily. You can choose language and country. I click on track keywords. It's going to take some time and it is going to fetch the results. So it is going to uh, crawl the top 10 pages of the search and it is going to give you 100 uh, top 100 results by default and it will tell you where you're standing okay now once this has been analyzed click on this and it is going to show where you're ranking at and it is going to show you the top 100 results for that so yeah that's it about the rule uh, i'm building this tool in public uh, so if you want to join the journey you can follow me on insta facebook twitter and linkedin uh, do give me suggestions if you think there is something that we can improve on uh, we love feedbacks and we're going to take it constructively and i've been building this in public just because of this reason so that rather than me building this alone we build it together with 500 other people so that's it thanks, thanks.